A professional theater company has taken residence at the Center for Positive Thought. We spoke with Ujima Company's founder and director, Warner Ujima Hill. Company is a vision of mine. It's the end result of several years of wanting to do serious theater group with a uh, theater with a group of seriously committed actors and actresses. Okay, so that is why a repertory company, having people in training to achieve a professional status which allows us then to do professional theater. We don't have professional theater of a black nature in Buffalo. We have community theater but not professional theater and that was that is my goal. So I invited a number of people to come here and to train with myself as the uh, acting teacher and with Kariamu as their dance teacher and we did have a, a a vocal teacher who we've lost but we'll get another one um, so that the training is well rounded initially and hopefully it will become even more so because we'll at some point in the near future be able to add uh, the technical elements theater crafts okay uh, lighting design and, and costuming and so forth. We'll begin, of course, on a, uh, the most rudimentary level imaginable because of uh, funding being what it is. But we've made a very good start with virtually nothing, with obviously the blessing of the Center for Positive Thought uh, and the people who run it, but with no you know, funds in hand kind of thing, really begun with the dedication of the people. Tell us a little bit about the company, how many members you have and so mm -hmm. forth. Okay, we have approximately 20 members, and it's about 50-50 men and women, and they come from various backgrounds. A number of them have done community theater for several years, and then another number have come out of uh, local colleges, Buff State, University of Buffalo, ECC. Um, everyone's had training of, of one kind or another prior to coming here. Our commitment is to uh, theater that is black in nature and first and foremost, well, first and foremost uh, theater that is generated within the group, okay? So the first piece that we're doing is And Bid Him Sing, and it's a collection of poems and dialects by Paul Lawrence Dunbar. I am adapting them for the stage. Oh, we want 